we back? Are we in Arctic Hell? Or is it just New York? I think it's just New York. Now then, let's go find Vinny Gogniti. I owe him an ass whooping. Is he still down there? <laughs> oh, I really hope that's not soft locking the game. Please don't be soft locking the game. Okay, drawing a mo. Oh, hey, look, I fucked up too. He's still, <laughs> he's still running. He's still running. Okay, that's pretty funny. Oh shit, I nailed it. Oh shit. Boys, can we take a rain check on this? No? Okay. I'll take a rain check. It's so that's a bad joke. And Max isn't feeling too well, and he's stuck. Come on, come on. There you go. Sit down. Now, where are some pain pills? I'm realizing playing this that Max Pain 2 is way more plentiful with that stuff. Marco! God damn, that was some distance. A John Max Pain? I want to cancel my Paramount. <laughs> Atlas, what you need to do is not support Mark Wahlberg. It's that easy. Also, was that a fucking painkillers? A. Also, is that a fucking reference to Civvy's cameo in Mandalore's fucking marathon video? Quick saving? Speaking of painkillers, where are some? Vinny? Wait. Is he supposed to be there? Yeah, that. What the fuck? It's pain! He's coming down the stairs! Shoot the bastard! Okay, boss, you got it. No I still have problem. control with that scene. Okay, that was jank. I wonder if this is- Wait, 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 wait. Survive that? What the f What? Okay, so the shotgun was the right idea. It's pain! He's coming down the stairs! Shoot the bastard! Okay, boss. You okay, got this is a little no hard to get problem. out of this situation. Can I can I stick the gun scene? Um How the fuck did I manage to get this far up? Yeah, I know they're there. They're coming after me. They're stuck. They're right there. Can you move? Max! Max! Max, what's going on? Max? Max! I literally can't move. <laughs> what the fuck? Did I? What is going on? I don't think he's feeling it. It's pain! He's coming down the stairs! Kill the bastard! Hey, oh. boss, you got it! No problem. Hey. What the f Am I just dealing with a soft lock now? Is that what I got? We just need to restart the chapter. Oh shit, that, I think they see me. Oh my. Oh no. Oh no, this is a great start. This is perfect. Everything has gone wrong. Oh, 
Okay. Um. I swear to God, if he's. Did, did, like, mission sequence break? Like, what the fuck happened? Excuse me, I'm experiencing a small glitch. Can, can, can it wait? Officer, can this wait? Excuse me, sir. Shit. Trigger the cutscene. It's pain! He's coming down the stairs! Shoot the bastard! Okay, boss. You got it. No problem. Oh god, if I run too far upstairs, it just locks me in. I can't do anything. How the hell am I getting out of this? Let's make a job for a hard restart. Oh shit, all of these are on chapter 7. Oh, am I fucking softlocked? Don't tell me I'm softlocked. Am I hitting new games? Am I gonna pick a chapter? No, it isn't. Shit, 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 shit. Shit. Okay, so my options are to somehow do this by without getting shot during this section to have enough point health points to make it through the next section. I don't believe what I'm seeing. This, this is, this is some just, okay. Wow. Someone's just bleed. Okay. Oh, please don't break anything. Please don't break anything. Please just don't break anything. You still right there? Can I, can I push you? There's that. Hopefully try and make it up the stairs. Don't it's go pain. all the way up the He's stairs. He's coming down the stairs! Shoot the bastard! Okay, boss. You got it. No problem. And then... Yo! Okay! Saving! We nailed it! Holy shit! That was more of a trial than it needed to be! And oh my god, there's health. The trick was to not shoot the guys who were shooting at us. Valkyr. God damn, that was... Ow. I see you down there. Holy shit, that's dumb. Okay, well, thank God I'm past the soft lock. That's all that matters right now. Hey, now you're dead. Come a little closer, buddy. There you go. I'll borrow those. Nice. That was fucking smooth, actually. Holy crap. Anything cool down here? 
You know, there's a Desert Eagle I can't use, which is moot, since I already have a Desert Eagle. Cool. Ah. <laughs> I'm just gonna quick save here, because this is Max Payne, and I know better. I hear you up there. I hear you, buddy. He's waiting for me. Shotgun shells full. Oh, let's fix that. As much as I love this game, I have to. Sending you to a Odessa. I'm getting sent to Odessa. I can't believe this game has different melee weapons. And fucking max pain in all games. Oh, holy sh! You guys are fucking stolen bodies down here. Holy crap! That's grim. Dickish enemy placement. Yeah, okay, he's got a good line of sight on me, and I'm basically dead. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on. Shit. Ugh. That's not where I wanted that to go. And I don't think that's phasing him. Okay, buddy. Pre-fired, it works. Now then. I'm gonna go grab the painkillers that are down here, because holy shit, this game hurts. Okay, so if it's not that way... I don't think Max can clamber. No. Okay, so what's the alternative? Is it actually jumping up this way? I'd be surprised if it was. No. Okay, what the hell am I missing? Jesus Christ, they hurt more than me. Yeah, I see you up there. Give me a second. I'm gonna go pre-fire your homie over here. Okay, let me kill you, then I'll think about what I'm gonna do here. What the hell am I gonna do? This cannot be the way. I have to be overthinking this. Yeah, that gap's way too big. Hmm. I'll grab the painkillers while they're there. Oh, 
Huh. There's that right there. Does that do anything? Yes, it does. Just had to find the call button. Is that so? Thank you. Oh, I would have had this bastard shooting at me while I was on the elevator with no cover. That's just mean. That's just mean. You got anything good? Just back 11? got grenades? Did you just get yourself with your own grenade? Well, this isn't turning out to be a spectacle. A spectacle I'm involved in, which is embarrassing, but it's still a spectacle. Who was this motherfucker who had grenade and didn't have any to spare? No. Oh, hey, Captain Baseball Bat Boy. That stuffed Vinny Gug needing a suit shape like that and just have to go bomb. That'd be really funny. Oh, hey, hope that's not important plot juice down there. Seems I have to go the way of the important plot juice. I could have made that landing a bit better. It's saving, because it's. Oh, fuck you! Oh, you horse's ass. Fine, I got two Mac 10s and no fucks. Take it, you coward. I'd like to use some of these grenades you guys seem to be offering, but you just... Gosh, you just don't seem to have enough. Yeah, Jim Bravura. Okay, so is this guy a mobster, or did he just get killed inside his own home? Well, I think he just got own zoned inside his own house. I mean, I'm not a detective. Max is, but still. Got a fucking shower curtain for your bed. I kind of like that. Okay, now look at this. We got a few goons down in there. And he's just waiting for you to pop through that door, right there. I'm gonna say case I ain't done that already. I'm gonna bust through there with both these guns. I'm gonna light them all the hell up. Marco! That is a strong TV. Hell, they get the guy around the corner. That was impressive. Ow. Hey. Okay, that went really well at first. Oh, 
Okay, so you guys think you're funny. Oh, shit. Okay, that time I lived. Seriously? Did I remember to grab the pills in here? Yeah, I did. Shit. Do I load the quick save? We'll see how this next combat encounter goes. Oh, was that my favorite dog needy mobster? Oh, for fuck! Fuck you! Oh, cool. I'm going to a boss battle with no health. This is awesome. Woo! Gotcha. Amazing. I'm gonna give you a lot less friends to work with here, buddies. Ow. Uh. Oh shit, I walked into a sawed off. Okay, who's the... Another grenade. Fuck it. Taking it. Jesus Christ, this is whooping my ass. Oh, cool. Now I'm just really dead. So now I'm about as dead as I was when I first came in. This is awesome. Okay, so he's gonna be down on the left. God, these sound effects are not the best. Oh yeah, I'm sure you will. Show your goon won't get me first. You can freaking... I can't think of a good New Yorker thing to say, so shut the hell up, Vinny! I not hit you yet. Ah, uh, this is getting interesting. And by interesting, I mean about as stale as three day old bread. Okay. Just when in doubt, be an action hero. And it works for the most part okay. Stuck in a New York alley, gut shot. One pistol in each hand. Lying dead. next main stuff. There we go. Now I have more health for this fucking fight! I had to say something, didn't I? Alright. I need to do all for I so hope greatly request. Thank you. Uh, burns my soul a little bit. Uh, this is truly the Dark Souls of Max Payne games. 
somewhere out there a Dark Souls spirit is wincing, and that makes me that makes me a happy, happy goat. Okay, I'm slightly under half health. Over? I don't know how this game measures it. It's just I have slightly more than last Open, time. God damn it! He's lousy, yet he chased you all the way here. What's that say about you, Vinny? You're really trying to hit me from that far with a 12 gauge? In this game? Shit, that's gone poorly wrong. And there's hell nowhere. Oh. Well, I ain't dead yet. But I am almost out of my ammo for the Mac 11s. Or Mac 10s. Is there a Mac 12? Oh, nice. to quick save. See, quick saving really is a double-edged sword. You get to make your own checkpoints, but you have to place them manually. Come on. <laughs> oh, this is going swimmingly. walking into the frontal face of a 12 gauge, and it's just so fun. Amazing. Okay, I'm not gonna give a fuck. Thank you. God damn it, this game and its lack of health pickups compared to number two. I, as much as I am enjoying this one, I fucking love number two. It's so fun. Awesome! I just took a fucking direct goddamn hit. I can do it. 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 I've done this before. I can do it again. And just... Quick save. There it goes. Fuck it, let's just put enough lead down range to make me... Uh, I don't have an analogy for this, I'm too tired of this crap. And you, Vinny. When we get to Max Payne 2, I'm gonna get some real good catharsis in, I hope you know that. Little mobster pain in the ass. Open, God damn it! No. Pain! I'll kill you, you lousy freaking... Well, if you don't, your goons will, which is entirely likely. Bait the grenade. Okay, so it's better to run past the grenade. Open, God damn it! No. Pain! I'll kill you, you lousy freaking cop! Quick save here. Fire you. Put out a lot of ammo. Excuse me, I'm burping. I hear you down there. Did I just jump down the stairs on accident? Oh, shit. Nice.
Come on, no takers? Okay. I'm gonna do this shit by the numbers till I get it right. I won't be stopped. Yeah, these Berettas hurt a lot more and their accuracy isn't entirely questionable. Okay, I just dumped almost a hundred rounds into you, Vinny. How the f <laughs> There we go. ran out of steam in a dead-end alley with steam boiling out of the sewer grates like all the fires of hell were burning high beneath us. It was shake down time. About Where's okay. Lupino? Screw you! Bad start, Vinny. Ah! Police brutality! I rate pretty high on that. You, you, you can't just hurt me in cold blood. Uh, just keep telling yourself that. Yeah, keep telling yourself that, Vinny. <gasps> Listen good, Candy Man. I'm not gonna be anybody's fall guy. I wanna know where your boss is hiding. There was no glory in this. I hadn't asked for this crap. Trouble had come to me in big dark swarms. I love to the do that. The good and the just were like gold dust in the city. I had no illusions. I was not one of them. I was no hero. Just me and the gun and the crook. My options had decreased to a singular course. I'll tell you, I'll tell you, just don't hurt me no more. <laughs> Lupino's at Ragnarok, the nightclub. Book me, take me in the whole minute to freaking jail, just don't hurt me. Ah, oh, what a pansy ass. Your rights will be ready at your funeral. Damn, Max. Ragnarok was Lupino's private nightclub, a den of drugs built into an old theater. I knew what waited inside. V had junkies ready to explode in random acts of senseless violence, and Lupino's goon squad, the worst stone cold killers this side of hell. Ragnarok was as inviting as a headache, flickering and flashing to a machine gun beat. The belly of the nightclub was a gothic theme park that began with bondage games and led to the nasty stuff from there. Well, I took a class act. with its dark messages, a cop killer bullet through the heart. Like father, like son. Just like Jack Lupino. Oh, cool. We came in the front door and we have no health. Zombie demons from outer space. I like it. Let's not use the front door because... Oh. I invite the Mac 11's equipped. Whoops. Yeah, let's stick with these guys. The book had never been a bestseller. Hang on, healing and saving. Given the setting, I was surprised to find that somebody had been passing time reading. The paperback was entitled, The Age of Murder and Storm. The blurb on the back mentioned Norse mythos and Ragnarok, the end of a Viking world with a terrible winter that covered the earth in ice, when vile crimes were rampant and all humanity lost. I could see how somebody impressionable might get it into their head that we were at the end of time. I was also beginning to see what the nightclub and its owner were all about. How many ends of time have I seen in my age? I think 2012 was the biggest, and that was a giant letdown. It's pain. Oh, fuck me. Come on in, boys. Water's warm. Jackass. You 
Kill over, thank you. You guys just leaving the merchandise on the table for anyone to take. Come on. God, you bunch of fucking amateurs. You know, I'm pretty sure this club really pops off at night, but damn, they need a bit more than just this. I mean, I say that, but I've also been to a goth club before, so... Where the hell do we go from here? No, seriously, where the hell do we go from here? Oh, only one of them works. Disco. Well, just like Mr. Newcomb, I hate Disco. Nice night, nice trench coat. Man, I just broke my tongue tonight. screaming in the next room. Painkillers, anything. You guys can take all the V you want. I just want the Vicodin. And ibuprofen. Books on the occult had been piled on the table. Oh, cool. Ouija boards. The room was stacked with light reading, such as Necronomicon, Witchcraft, and Paradise Lost. Old exotic titles like Malleus Malficarum and De Umbrarum Rainy Novum Portis. Books with pentagrams on their covers, all dealing with the occult and the infernal. Lying between stacks of horror videos and a couple of Ouija boards. The only thing I could take seriously was the thought of Lupino taking it seriously. He had been spending a lot of time getting intimate with the guy downstairs. That can be taken more way than one. What the? That is kind of cool. I like that eye mural. Damn, dude was taking a page out of my book. Okay, some smart ass is gonna throw a grenade. So! Oh, I love automatic closing doors. I really do. They're not a bane and a curse at the same time. They're just really good at locking me in with grenades. Did he? I think he got himself. 
Bravo, bravo, good show. I guess I get a chance to do this over. Nice trench coat, you know, when your bl midnight blade showing? And I still fucked it up. Oh well. Everyone here is dead. No one can hear me fuck that up. Except for the chat, of course. Why the fuck would you have a goth club and then put a sign up top that says, Disco? I get the feeling I'm not gonna bait out these jobbers. Okay. Fuck! <laughs> oh, that stung. Alright, take three. Your trench coat sucks. We're also outsourcing the writing of the insults. Whack him! Okay, this is going pretty well. Only to make things easy was just precognition to know that everyone was already there. Marco, anyone else? Hey, these guys are fin. This is made by a Finnish company. There's a solid chance that someone on the development team's name was Marco. Oh my god, that's a fucking stockpile. I'll take it. This is a really expensive nightclub. Should we really be decorating the place with 9mm? Just saying. Hmm. Oh, that door looks open. And probably leads to some pain, no pun intended. Ooh, shit, I just took a shotgun to the sternum. Nice. God, you'll be fine, Max. You're in a computer game. Hmm. I need to use that against someone. Oh, shit. I'll take the extra ammo, no complaints here. How the fuck are you supposed to reach these banis balconies just in general? Okay, looks like this door's open. Let me save, seeing as I have ammunition. Oh, well that's fucking grim. I mean, it's a victory, but it's grim. Jesus Christ.
Yeah, I see you down there. And over there. Anyone else? Who the fuck let Albert Wesker in here? Actually, no, if this was Albert Wesker, I'd probably be dead. Max isn't built nearly as sternly as Chris or Sheffa. if I get the howls of the damned again. That was kind of cool. What the f Did he just... Did you just blast your... What the hell do you guys need me for? You seem to be perfectly okay killing yourselves sometimes. Holy shit! Just flabbergasted by some of the shit I've seen you mobsters do. It's like, seriously, they don't need my help. They'll kill themselves and each other. And sometimes they'll also kill me. Most times they'll kill me, but still. Yeah, I think he's dead. Shit. Oh god, not a stairwell. Not a stairwell. I don't like gunfights in a stairwell. That's why! Oh, shit! Awesome. <laughs> okay. Cool, his guns that I need fell on the trap door that I need. This is going swimmingly. Thank you. Hmm. Actually, no. There we go. Oh, cool, the blizzard. Man, remember Blizzard? Remember when they made fun games? Hey, dude, your buddies in there are already dead. One of them wasn't my fault. Just saying. Where the fuck am I going?
Oh, you've got to be shitting me in this weather. No one better be waiting around one of these corners with a 12 gauge. I'm going to be annoyed. It's already precarious enough. I don't need the help. Oh, you have a fucking shot. I just had to say it. Nope, 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 nope. Yeah, I saw that. Oh, God, I hate gunfights and staircases. I hate gunfights and staircases. I fucking hate gunfights and staircases. Okay, this is gonna be nasty. Alright, I got 99 rounds. Oh, who wants them? What am I yawning? No, I'm not yawning. Oop. Is it really gonna be this easy? Are you guys really gonna make it this easy for me? Why the fuck is my... I'm gonna clean that if I get a chance. Oh, I see you down there. You coming up here? Coming up here to where, where everyone else is, where the party's at? You, know, you gonna come here and have some fun? Yeah, yeah, I think he is. I think you know what you're doing. Oh, wait. Does this count as corner camping? I feel like this counts as corner camping. Anyone else? Anybody else? Looks like one of the Karina Gibson Explorers. Incredibly low res and way more pointy than it needs to be, but still. I was not expecting to see that here. Nice. Stop bar. Looks like reflector knobs. Open coil pickups. Actually, no, it might not be a Karina one if it's got open coil pickups like that. That other would change out. Who knows? Karaoke never was my scene. Yeah, oh, you and me both, Max. You gonna say it again? Yeah. Someone's have a nice wireless system for their guitar to do that. Excuse me, anything cool back here? No? So they got a dance club and a stage behind it. Creatures of the Slain? Interesting name. Okay, so it has to be something over here. I can't tell if this club is actually possessed by demons or if someone's just getting fucking tortured back there. Let's check the center console. The mixing board. Actually, no, the mixing board was on the second floor, I think. Got enough brass to make an MG34 jealous. Yo. Whoa, fuck that. Yeah, I heard that, asshole.
<sighs> Where are you assholes getting all your fucking grenades? Oh my god, it's a puzzle. Nope, wait, not that one. Maybe? Yeah, I'm doing pretty good on, as far as health and stuff goes. Damn, they could really... Huh, that's... Kinda cool. Hey, was everything being violently tortured back there? Could you please stop? You're ruining the mood. Oh, what the fuck? You guys have this expensive rope and pulley stage system thingy, and you can't even just. Oh, this is gonna break. Who the fuck designs this? An empire of evil. <laughs> the backstage area led to Lupino's inner sanctum. The hot air inside was like an invisible wall, thick with incense and something else. A sickly sweet smell that made you gag. This was the rotten core of the Big Apple. Lupino lurked somewhere ahead, like a spider at the center of his web, waiting. The vapors in the air started to make my head swim. Torn pieces of a letter lay scattered on the sofa. Punchinello had threatened Lupino in writing. The note had been torn to pieces, bloody fingerprints all over them. Don't want you to think that one of my boys is not playing with a full deck. Shape up, Jack. We are running a business here. I'd hate to send the trio to strong arm you. The trio were the Don's notorious henchmen. Nice. It was obvious that Lupino hadn't been intimidated by the threat. Lupino's notes covered the table. Jack Lupino was crazy, all right. The table was scattered with notes of demented arcane nonsense written in rusty blood. Ew. A mishmash list of demons, devils, and dark gods evoked. Beelzebub! Asmodeus! Baphomet! Lucifer! Loki! Chitulu! Lilith! Hela! Blood given to you. I just keep throwing names up there. I want to respond to you. that old Faustian deal. Your soul for power and fortune. Just sign in the dotted line with your blood. So which one do you think you got at detention? Lupino's notebook lay on the pedestal. I don't think that's a notebook. Jack Lupino was crazy, all right. Mythic wolves let loose to devour the sun and the moon. Chase. Lupino is the wolf. I'm Mr. Beast. He is? The big bad Fenris wolf. I'm the end of the world man, wearing the flesh of fallen angels. Brutal. After Y2K, the end of the world had become a cliche. Holy but who was shit. I to talk? A brooding underdog Avenger alone against an empire of evil, out to right a grave injustice. Everything was subjective. There were only personal apocalypses. Nothing is a cliche when it's happening to you. I actually feel that last line. The flesh of fallen angels come to me all. Astaroth, Beelzebub, Asmodeus, Baphomet, Lucifer, Loki, Satan, Chitula, Lilith, Ella. Blood to you all. I think I actually hear him. Living under the skin of reality. Which means if I actually hear him, I have to shut him the hell up. That was in boss fight time. I get to shoot this crackhead. Come 
Come on, Wesker. You're not impressing me. You're not worth the name. You're not worth the time. Tuck and roll at me, you son of a bitch. Ow! How many of you fucking goons are there? Thank you. Okay, so am I supposed to do something or is this just a holdout? I hate not knowing I'm just supposed to do something. I think I shot him through the drapes. Here and I'm low on patience. I will rise to her side. I don't need the words. I'm beyond the words. Okay, so Lapino's lost his shit. Did he ever have it to begin with? I don't know. Okay, you're getting a bit spicy, buddy. so many times before I get bored. Seriously, how many of you guys are there? Fighting a wave of goons. Ow! You have come awesome. to the end of time. It's now! I will rise to her side! I don't need the words! I'm beyond the words! Burning their homies this time again. Uh, it keeps happening. There's, there really is no escape. All of you will die by friendly fire. It's not my fault. And they're all Albert Wesker!
Okay, here we are. I had known there'd have to be a catch in it somewhere, and this one was the Empire State Building of catches. The Vino was pumped up and dying to go 15 rounds with a mutant alligator. And then he started this spooky monkey talk, straight from a bad dream. Mine. I have tasted the flesh of fallen angels. We know. I've tasted the devil's green blood. It runs in my veins. Predators. I've green, seen beyond the green, world of green, skin. Green, actually, the the architecture of blood and bow and arrow. Death is coming. She is coming. And hell follows with her. Hmm? This is the twilight winter. I am ready to be her son. <laughs> her time is now. And all who stand in her way must die. <laughs> well, you're between me and her, so I guess it's gonna die! happen. <laughs> You'll die! You'll <laughs> die! Now! I like the stained glass mirror. Die! Stained glass. Uh, oh shit! Oh god, that's terrifying. Okay, take care of the ads. Did you just tank a 12? He is walking through Molotovs. That is some bullshit. Okay, buddy. Really, ow. Really likes wolves. Oh shit, I'm out of ammo for the Mac 11s. Yeah, could you keep that to yourself, please? Jack, buddy? Can I call you buddy? Can I call you pal? Can I call you toasty? <sighs> when in doubt, bring a finished drink. When the Pino finally went down, I wanted to make real sure he'd stay that way. Oh, he was shit. a bad monster. Turned them into friggin' zombie demons from outer space. I think Funny. he's dead already. Huh? And that's when it happened. For dead or not, you've got the wrong guy. In stepped this knockout femme fatale holding a gun to my face. I return the favor. Classy. Lisa Punchinello. Lisa Punchinello was the Don's wife. Mona Sachs. Lisa's evil twin. Your safety's off, evil twin. You might hurt someone with that gun of yours. Lisa's the damsel in distress. I'm the professional. I'd blow you away without batting an eye. Sure. Huh. And you can check Mona out my credentials spotted all over this joint. Jack couldn't have framed you. Not the state he was in. We're after the same slime bag. Angelo Quincinello's the one who murdered your friend and framed you with it. You know this for a fact. I've got my sources. I don't have a clue these days. I just shoot them as they come. I'll put a contract on the Archfiend. This one's mine. I hate the guts of that sadistic wife beater. <laughs> she Why sounds not pull our bullets for this one? I thought you'd never ask. My finger was starting to twitch. How do you like your whiskey? Max, that is a bad idea. Don't you dare. Don't do I'm that. Easy. As long as you don't try to slip me a Mickey. You're a real angel, Max. It was good stuff. Tasted sweet as honey going down. Nothing personal. Smooth. Get risky going berserk and getting loose and killed. Yeah, let the bad guy offer you a drink. The nightmare was always the same. Violent shapes moving in darkness, old and ugly. The killer's mad laughter was a riddle filled with wicked innuendo. Somewhere, the baby was crying. Oh god. I'm so glad I don't get motion sickness. And Max is running in slow-mo, and the hallway... The hallway... The hallways... Oh god, the hallways. 
go left <laughs> oh fuck they got me to an actual maze you bastards um further back. Oh god, I don't like this. Um, wait. Did it come from this way? Go Shit. I... Where the fuck am I? This way. We'll try that. We'll try it and see if it works. I just probably went the same direction. Fuck it, this hallway looks like it goes on forever. Why not? Follow the crying is actually working. Oh, you bastards. Is there is there any way out of this? Oh, first I get to a minor soft lock, now I get to this. The volumetric triggers are working still, that's good. Okay, so assuming this goes though, I think it is. That leads... Should lead to... A loop. I think this just leads, leads to a square room. in the corner. No, just darkness imprisoning me. All that I see. Absolute horror.
Holy shit, I made it. Should have known it when we found you snoring next to Lupino's corpse. A comedian, huh? The pictures were filled with good old times. Michelle looked at me from the photo. <laughs> the pain family. Happiness captured in a Polaroid moment. I had thought it would last forever. Till death do us part. <laughs> I didn't want to think about it. As long as I didn't, it could never happen. But I had broken my own rule. The thought had already slipped in. Fear was rusty needles poking at my brain. Cold and scaly, it slithered down my chest. Sounds lovely. I don't think I'm going that way. Um. Oh god, it's doing the thing again. It's it's doing the thing where the hallways, the hallways. The wet cartoons. Captain Baseball Bat Boy is my favorite. Let me tightrope on. Blood stains? God damn it, Max. Never trust a woman who puts a gun in your face. That is rule number one. Oh, cool. I got moon jumps. Okay, I also have good air control. Ooh, 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 God. Where the fuck am I going? Why is it all red? Why is everything red? And that's not the right way. Okay, get some distance. And leap! Uh, uh, nailed it. Go to the sound of the crying baby. The soothing sound of 14 crying babies. Okay. Fingers crossed I did not go in another circle. Oh, good. I didn't go in a circle. It's just the bloodstained room with the baby crib. Oh, it's it's arm is moving. I don't I no. No. No, no, please God, no. Uh, oh, that is not funny. That isn't funny. Holes, blow them to bits, vaporize them, disintegrate them. No matter what you do, they'll still be back, good as new. Yeah, Max's diary lay on the table. Oh, shit. <laughs> Max, no, please, Max. Why? I didn't mean to. I'm sorry. This is getting a little twisted. You killed her! Nothing like that ever happens in the real world. Okay. Well, this is off to a grim fucking end. Eh, not really a start. I woke up in a bad dream. My head felt two sizes too small for my brain. Max Payne. Sounds like a Tuesday. I envy your name. And the killer was smiling. Pleased to meet you. I'm Frankie to Bat Niagara. Niagara, as in you cry a lot. He had a baseball bat and I was tied to a chair. Pissing him off was the smart thing to do. Ow. Nothing wrong with a little laugh now and then. Take me, for example. 
I love to watch cartoons. Cartoon violence is a fascinating thing. It is. Let's take a break. I need to take a leak and maybe grab a cold one at the bar. Don't worry. I'll be back to finish this off. And then, it's checkout time. You play, you pay, you bastard. He swaggered out, and the door clanged shut behind him, locks clicking into place. Everyone makes mistakes. Mine hadn't been to crack jokes about the goon with the bat. He'd have cracked my skull regardless. It hadn't even been to trust a girl with a gun. No, that was a mistake. I had blindly gone after the first bad guy on my hit list when I should have been aiming further up the ladder at the head of the Punchinello family. Well, you start off small, how it works. I couldn't bring myself to be pissed at Mona. I guess I had a soft spot for a pretty face. But when somebody decides to play baseball with your head, you tend to get sore. Really? No shit. They had dragged me back to the basement of Lupino's hotel. I was beaten, bruised, and blue. I felt like the chair I had broken to get free. And we're back here. Where the hell they get this chair from anyway? All I had was Niagara's bat, sticky with my own blood. Frankie's men. I'd have to play hide and seek with them. Oh, fucking a melee in this game? Are you shitting me? Okay, so what door do I paranoidly go right through and, you know, charge face first into a barrel? It's Frankie's turf. What the hell does that mean? What does that equate to? Uh, that equates to me getting unloaded on by a deagle at point blank range. Fuck. 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 This is working. It's working. It's working. Fuck you. It's working. Succeeding in this. Mm -hmm. Holy shit, that worked. Saving. Like you were the smart guy. I literally just corner camp with a melee weapon. As far as some competitive games go, I am a massive asshole. But this is a single player game, so fuck them. Those grenades? Are those fucking grenades? Oh, you spoil me, game. My mouse pad is fucking dirty. I gotta fix that. Okay. This is looking good. Saving. I need to clean. 
clean my mouse at some point. That's probably the reason my aim's so fucking most of the time. Sure is! Sorry, but your buddy had a shotgun and a personal space issue. I wasn't looking to play. Another newspaper caption for a murder scene. Hang on, I'm looting. Frankie had left his calling card. A Captain Baseball Bat Boy strip next to a sewer passage filled with bodies. You'd better not mess with Captain Baseball, that boy. Even my arch. Cool. Oh, hey, this one actually had something. Loot. I'm sitting on a few frag grenades I probably don't want to waste. Putting a fucking newspaper comic. That's like murdering someone than putting a Garfield comic strip there. Who does that? Probably a deranged psychopathic murderer. It's pain. Oh, yeah, we got plenty of that here. Where the fuck did his buddy go? He was right. How the hell did he get over there so quickly? Oh, well. Shit. Oh, these fucking grenades. Boys, there we go. All four just for me. You shouldn't have. Don't I feel spoiled? Marco! Anyone there? Huh. It's all postage. I shouldn't be here. Is that a fucking police bus? Mobile arrest center. I can hurt one of those. Things were fast going from bad to worse. Yeah, holy shit. My fucking arm keeps itching. Come on, damn it. Outlines and tied it together with yellow tape. The cops who had stayed behind were dead. Frankie, his boys, and I had the place all for ourselves. Oh, hey, now it's the exact same level in reverse.
Now, hopefully. Just forget about it. <laughs> wow, forget he's in New York and someone's just saying just forget, forget about, about it. it. That crazy witch you should have heard her. She was a real scream when the boys caught her trying to cap the Don. Oh, that's freaking bad. To the trio? That's even worse than what Frankie's doing to that poor bastard downstairs. She's gonna take a long time to die. That's the mobster true. muscle on the phone was talking about Mona. Punchinello's trio were nothing but bad news. How encouraging. There he is! Hi, boys! More evidence that Punchinello didn't like as much. Clean up these big ass wardrobes. You know, it's entirely possible some of these guys were left behind by me. And hopefully, I don't walk in on someone getting a fucking blowjob. Well, that's not exactly better, but it's different. That's an ass. Do not disturb. Yeah, no shit. The hotel bar was fast developing quite a history. True to his words, Frankie was there, having a beer. Jesus Christ. How the hell did you get loose? Got bored waiting. Thought, what the hell, we could just as well finish this here. See, the problem with you boys that don't realize now is that this time... I got grenades! How the fuck did you survive that? Come on. Come on, Frankie boy. Oh, what you got? Ow. He's got me dead to rights. That's what he's got. No, I'm doing that over. You need to be dead by now. You know what? Let's try flanking him, seeing what happens. I think it'd be funny. Sit down. Take the Mac 11 ammo. Okay. Well, oh, guess what goat got a little too big for their britches? Charged headfirst into a boss fight with shit cover. Granted, that boss just tanked grenade where nothing but a business to suit. Worse. Oh hey, I got a cutscene. Now let's watch another cutscene. <laughs> just forget about it. Hey, just forget about it. Oh, I can't skip this one. Nope, here we go. A crazy witch. They have no idea. More evidence that Punchinello didn't like me much. <laughs> Is Punchinello like anybody? Okay, hang on. Now that I know what's happening, I want to walk in on that guy, John. Yo! <laughs> uh, I'm a bad person. Just gonna get these boys ready. Oh, fuck! Yeah, I see you right there by the bar.
This bastard is tanking grenades. That's cheating, sir. We don't allow that here. Son of a goddamn it. Oh, you gotta be shit. So what, two grenades? Oh no, Max is caught on the sign. Max. Max, I need you to start actually running. Frankie, worst of all my enemies. I literally don't know how many more rounds I can put down range until you finally, please, kill over. Okay, they know the Mac 11s are useful. They're giving them to this fucking jobber. Just have to wait for them to roll back into place with the grenades I don't have anymore. Put them to good use, I think. Okay, good, he's dead. Now I can do this. I have enough ammo, I will do this until you kill over, sir. There better be some painkillers underneath that bar. Thank you, thank you. You've been a lovely audience. Had enough? I don't play with girls anyway. I spotted the tail as soon as I left the hotel. A big black Mercedes. I had seen the car before. That time it had heralded impressive explosions. Vladimir was back. Bang. You're dead, Max Payne. I might have laughed if I remembered how. <laughs> Me in high school, for real, for real. What's this supposed to be? Cops and robbers? Look, you want something with me? Get in line. Peace, man. Relax. You know you are a real news item, armed and dangerous. Yeah. I am going to make you an offer you can't refuse. <laughs> I've always wanted to say that. It's a bum rap. I've been framed. Well, yeah, that's a moot point. Whatever you did or did not do, I'm sure you had good reason for doing it. Want to hear me out? I'm listening. <laughs> Cold day in hell. I feel like we've been through a lot of those lately. Conchinello messing with V is bad for business all around, but that's not all. There is this guy, Boris Dine, used to pull jobs for me. He's the captain of the cargo ship Charon. 
Now the bastard Turncourt has gone over to the other side, Ponchinellos. The ship's loaded with high-res hardware, guns, my business. If Punchinello gets hold of that cargo, he's won and I have lost. And you'll have your work cut out for you. Do I get some of that hardware? Do you want to get to Punchinello? You will need heavy-duty persuaders. I am just the man to get them for you. I'm listening. Change the ship back under my flag, maybe pop two in the traitor dime's head while you're at it. You'll get enough guns to start the apocalypse. You in or out? In. Let's get this show on the road. Vladimir was one of those old-time bad guys with honor and morals, <laughs> which made him almost one of the good guys. None of us was a saint. When are we ever? The Brooklyn Riverfront was a maze of rusty containers, sharp bone cranes looming up from the snowstorm. On a night like this, you couldn't help but think of the dark army of dead men sleeping with the fishes, cement shoes in line. No minotaur lurked in this labyrinth, but somewhere out there, on the clanking deck of his cargo freighter, the skipper of the k -Rod was waiting, like the ferryman in the river Styx. Is there some hell thing to back up that statement? No? Well... Some considerable progress. I think this is what I'm gonna call it for tonight. Game saved, that's what I like to hear. Oop. Good night, everyone. I might actually go to bed early because damn, I'm sleepy. Hopefully, next time should be yeah, should be able to stream later than this week, and hopefully with less yawning. I need to not deal with that. Granted. The last shift I had at work was a eight-hour shift that started at 10 a.m. Fuck that. Fuck that. That's too early. Ugh. God, do I want opening shift or closing?